Welcome back to the channel guys, welcome back to Just Shake or Steer with another cocktail video today and today it's all about bananas. Yes, I love bananas and I hope you do, but the cocktail, as much it's called banana cocktail, it won't include any real bananas, but it will have a banana liqueur. So if you're a fan of bananas, stick around and I'll show you how to make this very simple but delicious cocktail. All right, ladies and gentlemen, banana cocktail. Okay, it doesn't include any real bananas. However, I have them here because I can decide if I want to use it for a garnish. Even the cocktail requires just a fresh mint sprigs, which I have here. But I don't know, may change my mind until I make it. <clears throat> but anyway, let's make it first. So the cocktail, it's only four ingredients, very simple, very easy. Vodka, banana liqueur, lime juice and club soda. However, I'm changing the club soda today for a cream soda. The reason why is because I like the sweetness of the cream soda and I think it's pairing very well with the banana liqueur. Also, the vodka originally in the cocktail recipe is just a normal vodka, but I decide to use absolute vanilla to give a little bit more of flavor, a little bit more exotic feeling to the cocktail. So simple, all you need to do it shake just the vanilla and the banana liqueur. Now, you may say why are you gonna shake them when you, it's only two ingredients? Fair question. You can just build it in the glass. You don't need that. And you can just stir it. So what should we do? Should we shake it? Should we stir it? Hmm? Let's just stir it, okay? You don't need to shake because let me tell you something here. When you're shaking, uh, usually you have some ingredients such as uh, syrups inside or uh, some juice. So you help with the shaking to mix all together. When you pretty much have just a clear ingredients, just like a spirits and liqueurs and even just syrup without the juice, you can just stir the cocktail. But the reason why it's shaken is to cool it down. So when you put it in your glass, it's already chill and it's not gonna dilute your ice in the glass. So forget what I say, we're gonna shake it. Okay, grab your shaker, grab your jigger, 50 ml of vodka. If you are not fancy of vanilla vodka, you can change to mango or any kind of exotic flavor, maybe uh, citrus or just a simple plain vodka. It's up to you. I do like the vanilla one because it's very nice and yummy. And I think it's pairing really nice with the banana. However, as I mentioned, citrus will go very nice. And of course, the mango will go very nice. Right, we have 50 ml of vodka in the shaker. Now 25 ml of banana liqueur. Whoa, somebody's thirsty. And we're gonna put some ice and we're gonna shake it, okay? So let's grab some ice and let's just give it a good shake. You don't need to give it a much shake because it's just two ingredients inside, but just a little bit to cool it down and just introduce a little of dilution to the cocktail. <laughs> That's it, simple as that, a few seconds, don't need too much. And of course, let's strain this to our glass. Now we don't put ice yet in the glass and I'll tell you why. Let me just pour the cocktail first. Lovely, so far so good, okay. Now I'm gonna bring my lime and where is it? There you go. So half of lime Now you can use a lime squeezer, uh, if I can find mine. I'm very prepared as you can see today. Yes, you can use one of those lime squeezer, or if you don't have one, you can squeeze it just by hand, but I'll show you a little trick here. So when you get your lime, get your knife, just poke the lime in a few places and cut in the middle, okay? Just give it a nice cut in the middle so and start squeezing when you squeeze you can see the lime is going on the knife edge and just dripping lovely down and just move your knife little bit 
like a front and backwards to help you squeeze more of the lime juice. Simple as that, you see? If you didn't know this secret, now there you go, you know it. If you don't have lime squeezer or anything like this, that simply will do. And drop your lime inside. Okay, do not throw it, just drop it inside. Now we're gonna fill up the glass with ice. And just top up with soda, club soda, or like I mentioned, I wanna use cream soda because it's more sweeter and it's gonna pair fantastically with the vanilla vodka and the banana liqueur. Just a little bit, a bar spoon, just a gentle stir to help mix the soda with the lime juice, the vodka and the liqueur. That's it. And we garnish with the fresh mint sprigs. So get your mint, get the leaves, you don't need uh, anything else except some of the leaves. Give them a little slap, just so you release some of the flavor and just pop them in your cocktail. And then you have it guys, the banana cocktail. Simple as that. Ooh, yes, simple and delicious. I can see myself drinking this on the beach somewhere, just like a sunbedding and enjoying the view and chilling down. Obviously it won't happen this year. So holidays it's canceled, but at least I can enjoy it at home. And yeah, that's it from me guys. If you enjoy what you see, if you're new to the channel, consider to subscribe. Or if you're one of my subscribers, once again, thank you for watching. Hit the like button and leave me a comment. Tell me what is your favorite fruit, for example, what you wanna pair, what you like to pair with your vodka. And do you actually like bananas? I love them. So here we go. Until the next time, guys, and thank you for watching once again. Bye-bye. Ooh, that's yummy. Hmm. Yes.